I want you to get the scripture that you're going to stand on. So I was out last night, didn't get home to one. But nevertheless, I set my alarm to get up at three and the Lord woke me up at 2.30. And so then all I could hear was peace. The peace of God. So the definition of peace is really going to trip some of you all out. I looked up the word peace. Listen to this. The definition of peace is called the normal. It is the normal. It is how you're supposed to live. It says non-warring conditions. Come on, everyone say non-warring conditions. And that is what we supposed to have. It is supposed to be our norm to live in peace. So then the Lord gave me three areas of peace that we're going to pray for. We're going to pray for peace on earth. Peace on earth. Sure, we're going to cover the war in Ukraine, but also we're going to cover the war in your city. Come on, say peace on earth. For those of you that need a scripture for that, let's go 2 Thessalonians 3 and 16. Now may the Lord of peace himself give you peace at all times. Here's my line. In every way, the Lord be with all of you. And now may the Lord of peace himself do what? Give you peace. How often? At all times. And what? In every way. That's enough right there. <laughs> Can everybody say, may the Lord give me peace at all times. That means regardless of what is going on around you. May the Lord, only the Lord can give you peace when hell is going on around you. Not only that, in every way. Listen to this. For those of y'all that need peace in your homes, it's Luke 10 and 5. When you enter a house, when you, I'm sorry, when you enter a house, first say, peace to this house. <laughs> when you first enter a house, First, say peace to this house. Everyone open your mouth, say peace to my house. Aramasi. For those of y'all that need peace in your mind, Psalms 4 and 8. Now, this one, this one blessed me. Listen at this one. In peace, I will lie down and sleep. Because when your mind is tormented, it disturbs your sleep. It says, in peace, I will lie down and sleep. For you alone, Lord, make me dwell in safety. My God, for you alone, Lord, make me dwell. In other words, my mind is going to dwell in safety. Hallelujah. Come on, everyone say hallelujah. Hallelujah. So well, why are we praying for peace? Because First Peter 3 and 11, they must turn from evil and do good. They must seek peace and pursue it. If you want peace, you got to seek it. If you want peace, you have to pursue it. And we seek peace in prayer. We pursue peace in prayer. And we decree and we declare before we leave here, we will be in a peaceful situation. And we declare it is our norm. Come on, everyone say, peace is my norm. Come on, let's start it out with adoration. Words of adoration. There's a sound that go with prayer. Everyone begin to open your mouth and begin to release your sound. If you're online, we ask that you type words of adoration. You are the God that hears and answer. You are a present God you are the God that reign on the throne you never sleep you never slumber you never take a break you are alert you are the God that is alert you are the God that is aware you are the God that is attentive you know us by name hallelujah you're familiar with our voices 
and we give you praise on this morning. You even know the number of hairs on our head. You are the God that is into us and we say thank you for just being God. You are a great God. Mm. You are a great God. You are a strong God. You are a mighty God. You're the God that reigned on the throne and the earth is yours. Every spirit comes subject to you. Every man comes subject to you. Every knee shall bow. Every tongue shall confess. We give you glory on this morning. We open our mouths. We lift up our voices like a trumpet. We sound the alarm. Yay, that you are God. You are the only true and living God. God. Hallelujah. You are our creator. You are the alpha and the omega. You are the ancient of days. You are our creator and we give you glory. You created us in your likeness and in your image. You breathe into us the breath of life and we return that breath back to you by giving you glory. Hallelujah. We give you praise for being a God of love. For you so loved the world that you gave your only begotten son. And for that we say we say thank you. We say thank you for loving us. We say thank you for releasing a part of you to be to, for, to die on the cross and to pay the penalty for sin. And for that we say come on here we give you glory on this morning we give you praise on this morning for, for we should die for the wages of sin is death but God you release your only begotten son to die for our sins and for that we say thank you we thank you that he paid the ultimate price gave his life hallelujah and the blood still prevailed hallelujah and the blood still prevail we thank you God that when you look at us you don't see us wrapped up in this filthy flesh because no good thing dwells within us but you see us through the blood hallelujah you see us through the blood and whatever whom you did predestinate them you also justified and we give you glory God that you declared us to be righteous before we even became Came righteous and for that we say thank you come on here we couldn't do this on our own but now unto him that is able and for that we say thank you for being the God that is able to do exceedingly abundantly above all we could ask or even think our minds are too small to even grasp you Come on here. But God, we got enough sense to get up and seek you. We have enough sense uh, to open our mouths and praise you. We have enough sense uh, to make sure we give you all the glory. Make sure we give you all the praise. Why? Because you are our foundation. We stand on you. We stand on you. Everything else is going down, but you are the sure foundation. We don't have to search for another God. You are the only true and living God. And we give you praise that our search is over. Hallelujah. You're the lover of our soul. Hallelujah. You're our deliverer. You're our healer. You're our way maker. Hey. You're the God that go ahead of us. You're the God that clear the way. You're the God that level mountains and bring up valleys. And we give you praise that you are a very present help hallelujah you said that you would never 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 leave us never 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 forsake us Lord I am with you always and we thank you that you are with us every day every hour every minute every second you are a very present help and we cry Abba 
father. We are the children. We are your children. We are the sheep of your pasture and you are the good shepherd. And for that we say thank you. You're the shepherd that will leave 99 to come after one. Oh God, we give you glory for that. You are an attentive shepherd. You know us by name. You know our moans. You know our cries. you even familiar with our tears. And for that we give you glory. You even know what we have need of before we even ask you. What kind of God are you? Hallelujah. You are a good God. You are a good God. You are a good God. You are great in all of your ways. You are victorious in all of your ways. You never fail at anything. Victory belongs to you. Hey, Shia, come on, open your mouth. I say victory belongs to you. We stand as, as witnesses. We stand as testimonies that you are able to do anything. You don't fall short in any area. Jeremiah 32 and 27, Behold, I am the Lord, the God of all flesh. Is, that's a question, is, that's a question, is there anything too hard for me? me and we answer your question lord there is nothing that you cannot do hey shia we stand solid on that we hold our heads up on that there is nothing you cannot do you are able to do everything you are able to do anything but fail you are able to do everything you are able to do anything but you just can't fail and for that we say thank you 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 in spite of what it looked like God we rebuke the facts yes God we rebuke our eyes and what we see we rebuke what we hear and we stand on your word cause you cannot lie you are the God that cannot lie lie once you speak it it has to become our reality your word cannot 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 return unto you void so God we are the people of faith Hey, shake it. We are your people of faith. We are your children of faith. He that cometh to God must believe that he is and that he is a rewarder of those that diligently seek him. And we got up this morning to diligently seek the God that is able to do anything. I say we got up this morning to diligently seek the God God that can do anything. Hey, hey, you say we have not because we ask not. Well, we got up this morning to ask you this morning because we know that you're the God that hears. Your ear is not too heavy that it cannot hear us. Your hand is not too short that it cannot save us. You even give your angels charge over us. You can release legions of angels that will come to our rescue you. And for that we say come on here. I say for that we say thank you. You have done enough already. You have proven yourself. You don't have to do anything to prove anything to us. You have already proven that you are alert you have already proven that you are alive. You have already proven that you sit on the throne. And we give you praise on this morning. We praise you before we ask for anything, God. We want to praise you for what you've already done. Hey, shake hey, baha. What you've already done. Oh, God, the list is too long to read. You have done enough. 
you saved us you delivered us you healed us you provided for us you binded up the enemy you set the trap off of the devil you caused an ambush in the camp of the enemy you broke generational curses you regulated our mind you pulled our souls up out of the pit of hell you sit us in heavenly seats you give us power and authority you give us victory over every trap of the enemy oh God you've done enough already for us to give you glory you are patient you are loving you are kind you are faithful oh God great is thy faithfulness I say great is thy faithfulness you have been consistent you have been consistent when we weren't consistent you still remain when we failed you still remain when we tripped you still remain you never changed on us and for that we say what thank you hey you better open your mouth in this building hey we say thank you thank you for being the God that have a plan over our lives thank you when we tried to make a plan we didn't think big enough God but we want to thank you that you are the author and the finisher of our faith hey thank you that you counted us to be strong to put us in the battlefield and for that we say Come on, I need to hear worship again in this building. I need to hear praise in this building. For you have been good to us. You've been good to us. You've been good to us. We don't want to be like the children of Israel, murmuring and complaining. But God, we want to give you worship in the midst of a desert. Hey, shake a roto rebi under the Bahia. You told Moses, tell Pharaoh, let my people go so that they could worship me. Where? In a desert, in a wilderness. And God, some of us are in the midst of a wilderness on our way to our Canaan. So, God, as we journey, we don't complain. Hey, we don't murmur. No, you've been good to us. We got so much to say thank you for. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Open your mouths, everybody. I need your thank you to represent your house. I need your thank you to represent your life. I need your thank you to represent your journey. We say thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you that your ways are not our ways. Thank you that your thoughts are not our thoughts. Thank you that you are a holy God. Thank you that you are a holy God. We find no fault in you. We find no fault in you. You are perfect. You are pure. You are holy. You know exactly what you are doing. It is us that have the problem. You are the God. We find no problems in you. Hey, shake, hey. We find no problems in you. Hey, shake, hey. We find no problems in you. It is all on us. So we clap our hands in this building. We clap our hands in our home. And we give you praise. I say we praise you. I say we praise you. I say we praise you. You say that these hold their peace. You got to go and find a rock. Not on my watch. You never have to worry about looking for a rock. As long as I have breath in my body. Put a praise in my spirit. Put a praise in our belly. Hey, put a praise on our lips. Hey, put a praise in our spirit. Hey, let it be a fountain of living water springing up out of us giving you glory people are cursing and complaining what are we doing we giving you praise come on I need to hear you we giving you glory yay we giving you praise we giving you glory let this be our life let this be the way we live. Let this be our, our, in our DNA, giving you glory, God. Make me an instrument of praise. 
Make us instrumentous praise. When we breathe, let it give you glory. When we talk, let it bring you praise. When we clap, let it bring you praise. When we bow, let it bring you praise. When we dance, let it bring you praise. When we get up out of the bed, let it bring you praise. How we live. Come on a few more seconds. Glory. Come on, y'all, a few more seconds. I need you to push. Those online, I need you to begin to open your mouth. Whatever city you in, whatever state you in, I need us to enter into corporate praise right here. We are not asking for anything yet. We're just giving you glory for what you've already done. We're not asking for anything yet. We're giving you praise for who you are. You are amazing. You are mind-blowing. You're the lover of our soul. You are our deliverer, our way maker, our comforter, our counselor. You keep us in perfect peace. And for that, we give you praise. In spite of what's going on, we still lift up our voices. We stand on top of all the hell we might be going through. And we still remain consistent in giving you glory. Come on, y'all, release your sound. Hallelujah. 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 We irritate every demon. We irritate every spirit. We irritate every devil from the pit of hell by giving you glory. Hallelujah. We remind the enemy how far he failed by giving you glory. Glory! glory, to God. glory to God. Come on here. Make a joyful noise. We're not complaining. We're not crying. We're giving you a joyful noise. We're not complaining. We're not crying. We're giving you a joyful noise. Yay! Clap your hands, all you people. your voices like a trumpet let my voice be an instrument of praise let my sound penetrate the atmosphere let my sound set the temperature glory there hallelujah to the God that is present to the God that answers to the God that hears to the God that comes to our rescue we give you glory you to let the devil know he lost already I need you to let every demon know that we are among those that are victorious open your mouths glory Hallelujah. 
glory. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, God. Come on, I need you to release a praise with a smile on your face. I need your countenance. Oh, Baba Shaya Masanda. I need you to release a praise with a smile on your face. Your face cannot be downcast. Your attitude must be right. Your body language must be welcoming. Give him glory. Come on. Holy God. Holy God. Hey. This is how we fight our battles. Yes, This is how we give you glory. This is how we bind the enemy. Yay, God. My soul make a boast in the Lord. My soul make a boast in the Lord. My soul make a boast in the Lord. And I will not be embarrassed. I will not be brought to shame. What you didn't do then, you'll do now. So I give you glory. <laughs> I need you to make sure you're doing it with a smile on your face. I don't care if you got to force yourself to smile. Lift up your head, oh ye gates. Open your mouth and release a praise right there. Glory. Come on, you better create your atmosphere. You better create your atmosphere. Thy kingdom come. <laughs> Thy kingdom come. You gotta create an atmosphere for the for his throne to shift in your direction. Thy kingdom come. <laughs> To the promise keeper. Hey. To the one that is able. To the God that can never fail at anything. To the God that we trust. Wow. Yay. Yeah, my, 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 son. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. Yay. My praise is not in vain. Get out, Messiah. Oh, God. Hallelujah. Come on, we're going to move. Ain't nothing like getting locked in a praise. Get out by say, say yando. Oh, God. <laughs> Hallelujah. Come on, we're going to move. Mm. Yay. Clap 
their hands and say, thank you for what you've already done. Come on, tell them, you've already proven yourself. You ain't got to prove nothing to me. I got enough evidence. Get up, I the non-believer need proof. I'm a believer. Mm, yeah. Those of y'all that believe that he is able, I need you to release a praise to the God that you believe in. If you don't believe in him, don't praise him. <laughs> yeah. Hey. Hey. To the God that healed. Shaya mm. batatarabasi, sheyanda rabuho, to the God that removed tumors, yeah, sheyando batatari anda rabuse, yeah. Come on, if you don't believe in Him, don't praise Him. But I need to hear a praise from the believers. I need to hear praise from the believers. You still wait on him to do it, but you believe. Why you wait? Come on here. Why you wait? Put some on the records. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. you get your strength back if you give him praise you get your spot back mm. he'll restore unto you the joy of your salvation hallelujah sit in the seat of the intercessor for five minutes because we got to send some prayers in that direction and bind up this Putin the spirit of pride the heart of the king is in the Lord's hand you can control the heart. You can control the mind. You can control the emotions. You could flip a thing. You could switch a thing. And we come against the spirit of pride. Yes, God. Mm. Yes, God. This haughty spirit. Yes, God. This demonic spirit from the pit of hell. Oh, we see you, devil. 
You God are able to turn a thing And we pray right now On behalf of those that can't pray We even pray for those that don't even know you yet and we intercede and we come against the spirit of war y'all ain't praying like I need you to pray I need you to pray like a bomb just dropped in your front yard we come against the spirit of war we come against an invading spirit we come against a territorial demonic spirit that devil is a liar you are able to flip this thing in the name of Jesus I pray that you send the right individuals that can speak to that spirit hey Torabaha and make it humble itself right now we bind every devil every spirit every camera is watching mm. the world is watching and God we need the world to see you humble the devil peace on earth we cast down the words of the third world war y'all better pray we come against nuclear weapons God this is like a battle between David and Goliath and God the same way you raised up David we pray God that you would raise up Ukraine y'all ain't praying we call God we pray that the strong mighty God get in there cause an ambush y'all ain't praying here we go cause an ambush in the camp of the enemy confuse the devil on every hand let them start turning on each other God, you said when the children of Israel shouted, it caused an ambush in the camp of the enemy. So God, we're going to stand as intercessors and we're going to shout on behalf of Ukraine. And we need you to cause an ambush. Let those that are in the army start dropping their weapons. Let them decide, I don't want to fight. Make them decide that they don't want to drop bomb. We cause an ambush in the camp of the enemy. We release a shout like we are in the middle of the war. Open your mouths and shout. Shout like it's your children. Shout like it's your country. Shout like they're getting in your house. Shout like a bomb just blew up in your backyard. Shout. Confuse this devil. Confuse this spirit. Bind up this enemy in the name of the Lord Jesus. Let the world see pride come down. Okay, I'm praying like I'm violent. I pray for Ukraine. Now you pray for the earth. So Father, in the name of Jesus, we pray for peace on earth. You said in your word, God, that you look for a man among them that would pray, that would stand in the gap, that would make up the hedge, and you found none. But this morning, God, here we are in prayer, the house of prayer, your house. You said that your house shall be called the house of prayer. Come on. Here we are, God, in the building. Here we are online God and we're asking you God to bring peace on earth hey. we pray like Jesus taught us oh, you right. said pray come thy kingdom and be done thy will on earth as it is in heaven it is your will God that we dwell in peaceful places so this morning we pray we reiterate come thy kingdom be done thy will on earth as it is in hey. heaven let there be peace on, on earth. earth. You said in your word, God, that if we were to call upon you, uh, that you would answer us uh, and show us great and mighty things uh, that we know not. Uh, we on. call upon you uh, and we say, God, let there be peace, peace 
on earth in the name of Jesus. For some of us, Lord God, war has been the norm. For some of us, chaos has been the norm. But the devil is a liar. We pray, God, restoration to what you intended. And you intend for us to walk in peace. So we pray, Spirit of the living God, arise in our cities and bring peace. Come on. Jesus, you are the Prince of Peace. And we're asking that there will be peace on earth. We thank you this morning for the power of prayer. We thank you this yes. morning that there are intercessors in every city. We thank you this morning that there are intercessors around the world praying for peace. God, we need your help. Do it for us, God. In the name we of cannot Jesus. do this without you. This is a God thing. So we posture ourselves Jesus. in the place of prayer and we say peace, peace in the name of Jesus. We speak to chaos and we say be still. Yes. We speak to chaos and we say be moved for you have declared that if we speak to the mountain Come and on. say be thou removed and be cast into the sea and not doubt in our hearts Come on. but believe that those things that we say shall come to pass. We shall have whatever we say. So we speak peace. peace. We speak peace. Bring calm in our city. Bring calm in our nation. Come we on. pray and bind the spirit of division. We bind, God, the spirit of war come on. that is warring, yeah. God. We bind, God, those that will try to rise up and cause, God, wars to break out. For you have declared, God, blessed is the peacemakers. God, raise up peacemakers. In the name raise of up Jesus. those with wisdom. Raise up those, God, who know how to get in and navigate a situation that know how to put out a fire before it starts. In our city, God, in our land, God, in our nation, we pray for peace. Yes. We don't just pray to be praying, but we pray for results. We pray Come that on. even right now, that as we pray, we don't pray just to be praying, God, on. but we pray for, for results. results. And we pray that the news will answering. announce that peace is happening, that the media will announce Come that on. the war is over. Yeah. We pray Chicago. that on every newscast, right. ba, 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 they will Seattle. say that Chicago is a peaceful city, oh. that crime has gone down, that the war has ceased. We pray for headlines that let us know that you are the God who answers by fire. Come on. We pray, Lord, for the, even the media to announce that didn't nobody do this but it's God. It's a miracle. Hey, God, let, Lord, let us see results. Hey. My God, we're not praying for show. We're not praying for Come people on. to celebrate us. We're, we're not praying, praying for God. Results. But we're praying for results. results. Let there be peace on earth in Jesus' name. Those online, I need you to put your country and your state. Those in the building, whatever city you live in, whatever state you live in, just release it out loud right now. We release these countries, we release these cities, we release these states. And we decree and we declare that peace is hitting the earth right now. Peace in our community, peace in our neighborhood. Come on, whatever city you're in, we need you to release it online. We cover your city because spirits are regional. And we pray that God will begin to deal with the spirits that are in your region. So now we cover your home. And you will live in peace because this is your norm. Mm. This is your norm. Come on, everybody say peace in my home. Do me a favor. Say your street name. Say your street name. Come on here. Say your street name. I need peace to be on your block. Come on here. We plead the blood of Jesus over your house. We come against the spirit of conflict and confrontation. No arguing, no bickering. The devil is a liar. 
Y'all ain't praying that way. I need you to pray. I pray over your house. Adamashai. Over your relationship with you and your children. Mm -hmm. Come on, Chris. Pray. Father, we thank you. We love you and we appreciate you, Lord. And this morning we are praying for peace in our homes. Lord, we pray in the name of Jesus uh, that you begin to feel the atmosphere in our homes Come on. Uh, with your presence. We Come pray, on. God, that you would replace uh, the, the devices of the enemy that have been put in our homes, God. Replace this function with peace. Replace arguing with peace, peace. in the name of Jesus. We come against bickering, God. Come on. We come against frustrating and tormenting spirits come on. that have been placed in our homes. Hey, Father, now, we bye, decree bye, bye, and bye. declare that our homes are a place of peace. Father, we pray in the name of Jesus uh, that we that you would cover our homes, God. Come on. We ask that you would bring a cease, God, bring an end to confusion Come on. in our house, God. I pray uh, according unity. to your word, for it is written in thee, uh, O Lord, do I put my I trust. trust. Uh, let me never be put to confusion. Father, we pray against the spirit of confusion come on. Uh, that is plaguing our homes. Father, we even come against deception in the house, God, against the children and the parents, God. We come against manipulation in our homes that comes to compromise the peace that come you on. came to give. In the name of Jesus, we pray that you begin to loose angels, God, in our homes, yes, God. God. We ask that you begin to answer the silent petitions of prayer come on. that have been released in our homes. In the name of Yay. Jesus, we come against fear that may have planted itself in our our homes, the fear of being sick, the fear of depression, the fear of not having enough. And Father, we pray that you would replace these things with peace, for we know that you are our provider. We know that Come you on. are the one who is able to do anything. So Father, this morning we are asking that you would enter into our homes. Come Father, on. You're we welcome. repent, God, right now in the name of Jesus Lord, for adopting the ways of this world, for the Come world on. has been stressing the world has been tormented with fear and father many of your people have adopted these traits but this morning we are asking God that you would replace these things with your peace in the name of Jesus for it is written you keep in perfect peace those whose minds are steadfast because they trust in you father we ask that you would release peace, peace. in every household in every the name house. of Jesus we come against frustrating spirits come God on. we come against all arguing God we come against a lapse in communication Lord we ask that you begin to bridge the gap come that on. is current hey. in the ba -ta 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 household street. in the name of Jesus we pray that you be the foundation of every home and on your foundation we begin to build peace in come the on. name of Jesus Father I pray God that you begin to help us reconcile in the home God Yay. for this has been a tough last two years God but we pray in the name of Jesus, Jesus. for a spirit of reconciliation to take yes. place in the home, God. No more bickering, no more going back and forth, no more lack of trust, but today uh, we decree and declare that we have peace. peace. We call those things be, that be not as though they were, uh, and we decree and declare that our homes are now a place of peace, God. Every spirit that is unlike you uh, that Come is on. taking up place in our home has to go in yes. the name of Jesus. We decree and declare that our homes are now a peaceful place. Father, we even ask that you begin to remove sickness from the house hey, for somebody Shia. who's been suffering in Hold their body. Up. And as a result of their suffering, God, they have had a lapse of peace. But God, it is written in your word, God, that our homes will be a place of peace, peace. God. So I pray in the name of Jesus that you will cover our homes, God. Let our houses be a place of rest and let no plague come not our dwelling in the Yay. name of Jesus. Cover our homes with cover. your blood, God. Cover our homes cover. with your blood. Cover the mindset of every individual that lies within the house, God. Cover the mind of the father. Cover the mind of the child. Give us peace in our home. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. Everybody, stand to your feet. Stand to your feet. And let's obey the Holy Ghost. Do me a favor. Close your eyes and get a vision of your house. And I want you to get a vision of your bedroom, that you're standing in your bedroom and start praying over your bedroom right now. 
So we cover our bedrooms. We come against every demonic spirit that want to attack us in our sleep. The devil is a liar. We pray that we sleep in peace. We come against nightmares and tormenting spirits. The devil is a liar. We pray that your peace would be in our bedroom right now. No tormenting spirit, no demonic spirit. We even cover the bedrooms that our children sleep in. For God, if any of our kids have brought any kind of witchcraft into our house, I pray, God, that you would give every parent a gift of discernment. Let them find anything in their house that should not be there. And I pray, God, that you would give them the ability to begin to remove stuff that the enemy has put in their atmosphere. In the name of Jesus, we cover the eye gates and the ear gates that are in our home. We come against the music that our children are listening to. And we pray, God, that they will be sensitive to the spirit. We come against a tormenting spirit in our house. For God, we decree and we declare that our home will be our place of rest. Our home will be our place of rest. In the name of Jesus, every outside force we bind it, every outside witch that's trying to get inside, we bind it. The devil is a liar. We plead the blood over the doorpost. Come on, y'all, in your mind, I need you to imagine you laying hands on your front door. We plead the blood over our front door. Hey, shake, hey, those that live in apartment buildings, let that apartment be separate from every other apartment in that building. I don't know what's going on in the building, but as for me and my house, we are covered in the name of Jesus. The peace of God is in your house. We come against the demonic spirit that want to tell you you're lonely. We pray that God will give you comfort. We come against fear that you're going to die by yourself. We tell the devil he is a liar in the name of Jesus. And we decree and we declare, let's go. We're going to live. Everybody bind death in your house. And the peace of God. And the peace of God. Everybody do me a favor, lay hands on your head. Peace in your mind. No nervous breakdown. You will not be going into a mental institution. The devil is a liar. We call your thoughts to come in. We come against scattered thoughts, tormenting thoughts. No. No, not accepting it. Come on here. Come on, lay hands on your own head and say the peace of God. Come on, Cynthia. Lord God, we thank you for the peace of God that surpasses all understanding, that keeps our hearts and our minds through you. So we thank you, Lord Jesus, that the peace of God that surpasses all understanding keeps our hearts and our minds through you. God, we thank you for the peace of God Come on. that surpasses all understanding, keeps our hearts and our minds through you, for you will keep us in perfect peace. You'll maintain us in perfect peace. Come on. When we keep our minds, when we maintain our minds on you, Come on. so we dismantle every attack of the devil on our minds. We dismantle every infrastructure of the devil in our minds, in our thoughts, in our anxieties. I come against the devil in the name of Jesus that wants to cause confusion in our minds, that wants us to have a nervous breakdown, that wants us no. to be confused and scattered. I speak the peace of God that surpasses understanding. We will live in peace in our minds. Peace be still in our yes. minds. Peace be still in our thoughts. Peace be still in our hearts. Peace be still in our goings and our comings. We will not be anxious for nothing. Come on. We thank you, oh God, in everything we'll let you be made known. And the peace of God that surpasses all, all understanding, understanding keeps our hearts and our minds through you, Lord Jesus. So I speak right now that every diabolical attack of the devil is broken and destroyed Come on. in our minds. And I release the peace peace of God. I release the peace of God. I release the peace of God. Saints of God release the peace of God. Saints of God accept the peace of God. The peace of Receive God. Receive the peace of God. 
receive the peace of God in your minds that your relationships are whole because of the peace of God that your homes are safe because of the peace of God that your workplace is different because of the peace of God I break it down right now I break the back of the devil that does not want us to be at peace but we will be at peace in Jesus name peace in our minds peace in our thoughts peace as we go and come no more anxiety no more frustration no more paranoia but the peace come of on. God but the peace of God the wind of God the rock of God in our minds in Jesus name hallelujah come on let me stay there for a minute let me stay there for a minute lay your hands on your head again yes God for when lust is conceived come on. it brings forth sin first place that it is planted is in your mind when lust is conceived it brings forth sin and when it is finished it brings forth death resist the devil and he will flee so we pray God that you would give us the ability to resist the devil in our mind mm. give us the power and authority to catch that thing when the enemy present it in our thoughts Give us the ability to send that back to where it came from. In the name of Jesus, we will not meditate on it. We will not think on that thing. We're going to resist it, and it will not torment us. I lay hands on our on my head right now, and I pray, God, whatsoever things are just, whatsoever things are honest, whatsoever things are lovely, whatsoever things are pure, that we begin to think on these things. We come against every lie that the enemy is planting in our mind. We come against a bipolar and a schizophrenic spirit that devil is a liar we are your children and we would not embarrass your kingdom by losing our mind that devil is a liar if it's in our bloodline if schizophrenic and bipolar behavior is in our bloodline god we have been changed by your blood and we would not accept what happened to them that is going to happen to us that devil is a liar the curse stops here we come against thoughts of depression we bind up the spirit of suicide we come against quitting we pray god that you will put joy in our mind we pray god that you will put happiness in our mind man we decree and we declare that we're gonna live to declare the works of him that sent us god we're gonna be happy starting in our mind we pray god that we be satisfied with you in our mind we come against the enemy that want to make us go see a witch or a fortune teller that devil is a lie we will not have a wandering mind neither will we have a wandering spirit in all of our ways we're going to acknowledge you and you only we would not be a part of this world that are getting into crystals and stones but we stand on the true foundation y'all ain't praying like I need you to pray we come against zodiacs and all that mess we bind that up in the name of Jesus we come against any unfamiliar spirit that's tormenting us in our mind we would not be tossed to and fro by every wind of doctrine we even pray God uh, that you would bring our minds uh, to be settled in you we would not eat from every table we would not run to and fro seeking a word uh, but God we seek you why am I feeling some resistance in the spirit realm We come against control of the mind. We come against any form of religion that want to control your mind. We bind every cult spirit. We bind every cult spirit. We bind every cult spirit. 
spirit. We bind God in the thought of making a God out of preachers and teachers. God, the devil is a liar. We come against any preacher that want us to make a God out of them that's going to mess with our mind. We come against the spirit of manipulation and control. He whom the Son sets free is free indeed. And we are free in our Come on here. I come against a tormenting spirit that keep bringing up your past. The devil is a liar. We would not live in shame, guilt, and condemnation, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind. Your past is not your issue it is under the blood we bind anybody that want to keep bringing up your past parents I bind your children who want to make you feel guilty over your past I call you to walk in the liberty where with Christ has set you free and be not entangled again with the yoke of bondage in your mind we gotta go we pray at the, at the top of March in the last in the first quarter of the year and I pray God in the first quarter of this year that you give us the mind to make it through the year come on we about to go now <laughs> I pray that we be focused I pray that we not be all over the place I come against confusion I pray that we be focused on our goals and our desires but let the record reflect we're going to live this year. Mm -hmm. Everybody release a praise for peace on earth, peace in your house, and peace in your mind. Come on, release a praise. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! And for that, we say thank you. And it is so in Jesus' name. Don't forget tonight at 8 o'clock, Pastor Jamon will be doing the Afterglow online. Thursday night Bible studies are open in this building. The earth is open. Hear me clearly. Masks are now optional. If you want to wear a mask, you wear it. If you don't, you don't have to. But if you don't wear one, we ask that you do respect those that do have it on. Amen. Everybody say, peace on earth. Peace in my home. And peace in my mind in Jesus name God bless you consider yourselves dismissed no one walk alone down the street God bless you